Here's this week's Kiss the Cook, sponsored by United Supermarkets. Well, welcome back, everyone. Okay, so September has so many fun things going on. We've been talking that it's National Family Meals Month. It's also Hispanic Heritage Month, so I'm gonna combine those two tonight, and we're gonna make a chorizo nachos, because it's also game time. So what a perfect way to celebrate and enjoy your favorite game this weekend and cheer on your team then with an easy uh, meal, lunch, dinner, whatever it may be. So I'm gonna use some of these grain-free tortillas. So this company, Siete, you see me use them a lot and I really like them. One, I love that it's a family story. They're from here in Texas and there was a daughter or a sister, depending on who you were, that uh, needed to go grain-free for health reasons. So the whole family joined her and they make this amazing line of products. So I'm gonna start with some of their chips. And then they also have um, a packet of seasonings. And some of them are for tacos, some of them are for chorizo. So what I did was a pound of ground pork and I seasoned it with the chorizo seasoning. And I've already cooked it up. So we're gonna put that on our nachos. And that is such an easy way to add great flavor. We didn't add a ton of fat or calories in there. So you kind of sprinkle that on there and get that all done. Okay. Now, these hacks actually have some beans, and I did use their beans. I like that they use avocado oil in a lot of their products. So I took some of um, the refried beans, and I put in a little bit of warmed broth, and mixed it up with some onions that I had already cooked up, and a little bit of the chorizo seasoning packet. And the reason that I added some broth was so that I could kind of drizzle it over the nachos, because if you try and clump them, sometimes that doesn't work as well. Okay, then we finished topping. I've got some uh, zucchini that I sauteed up and just kind of put it in a little bit of avocado oil. We're gonna top it with our queso fresco, pop it in the oven for a few minutes, and then we finish it off with avocado, tomato, cilantro, and a squeeze of lime juice for delicious dinner tonight. All right, guys, enjoy. <laughs> 